You know, it's funny. The whole Skyward Sword thing, uh, big Zelda 25 anniversary, is uh, it's not it's not getting me as excited as most other gamers are because I started out with Pokemon and Ninja David. I will enter your code if you PM me through YouTube or Twitter. Um, but I didn't start out with Zelda like a lot of other hardcore gamers did. I actually came across it by Twilight Princess. And I had slight short encounters with it before that, but I never got to experience the game. So this whole 25th anniversary celebration thing isn't getting me as excited as most of other people around the gaming community are. But I'm still pumped to see what they're going to do. And I'm really excited for the game, just because it's not my main series that I pay attention to doesn't mean that I'm not pumped for the game. And actually, comrades, speaking of Wind Waker, I actually... It's a funny story. Did you all see the video that Matt Goldman put out yesterday about what happened to Epic Mickey? Oh, sorry. Getting ready to a reply. Yeah, so instead of recording Epic Mickey footage because the save file was lost for people who are watching this on YouTube recorded later, um, the save file was lost of Epic Mickey, so our Let's Play, uh, co-op Let's Play with me and Matt Goldsman, it's not going to happen anymore. It's a sad thing, but that's also why I decided, Ugh, Portal in, in Portal 2. So I always want to say Portal 2 now, but Portal, Epic Video uh, LP in one night. It says I've contacted you, but it is just syncing up. There. Probably helps if I can turn on the volume. But instead of uh, filming that, we recorded some Wind Waker footage, because he's got the LP of that going on his channel right now, because he's trying to complete most of the Zelda games in the 25th anniversary of Zelda. So he, he is a big Zelda fan all about Link and his many adventures with his Master Sword for Princess. So, you know, he, if you go check out his channel soon, I don't know when he's going to be posting it, but I appear on a couple of the episodes. Gamers Cast is the website that Matt runs, and it's also his podcast. I used to have my own website and podcast a couple years ago, it was Nintendo Radio, but it never took off anything like my YouTube is right now. So that's why I'm focusing more on that. And who knows if I'll rebuild a website in the future. I don't really see the need to. Just because Twitter and YouTube and the live casts... Oh, we have contact. Oh, two. Two people come. Wow. I should probably get on one of these platforms, right? Maybe? All hail, whenever I contact, it just keeps loading. Strange. Hmm. Oh, technical difficulties for the first time, not, not a surprise. I defeated Black, the main game. I beat the Elite Four. And I'm right about to go after Kiyu Remu. And my Black City is empty. It's completely empty because there's nobody around here who has black or white that I can have go on to Entrelink with me. It says that it contacted me, but it's only got a loading screen. Here, I'll show him. Not lying to you. Loading. Oh, wait. Hmm. Alright, what if I cross transceiver? Yes, image data, fine. I'm going to start a cross transceiver invitation, and then maybe you guys can just join that. My friend code for Pokemon Black will be... Well, I know that it's somewhere in this chat, so if you want to scroll up it yourself, you can. If I do that on the video, though, 
while it's being recorded, it's going to mess things up for people on YouTube, so I won't. And um, what kind of trainer am I? I don't know what you mean by that. Yes. Let him join me. It says that you want to join me, but it's not letting me join. What the hell? But my friend code is going to be on Twitter, so you can just go there when I post it. It's going to be in the description of what it is that I do on Twitter. I don't know why this isn't working. It says all hell wants to join, exclamation point, and then nothing. Maybe. Ah, why does it jump like that? <laughs> Jeez. What's your question, Die Hard 243? That's what the live cast is all about. Asking me questions to get a better understanding of who I am. While I do the Let's Plays for you. <laughs> That's cool. We should definitely do more brawls. If this cross transceiver talk doesn't work out well, maybe we'll... Because the idea was that we'd have a guest on the show today, and every week we'd have a new guest via cross transceiver, but if it's going to be this wonky, I don't even know if we should do that. We should probably just stick to Skype. That might work better. I don't know. Yeah, your city won't, or forest, won't actually grow if you don't communicate with people, live people, who have cartridges on Ontralink and visit their city or forest. Oh, yeah, the thing about console commands. Hold on. Chat, why do you do that? Poke Trainer has contacted me. All right, let's see. I don't. I forget who Pokemon Trainer is. I don't know why. Okay. I don't think we're going to be doing any console commands for the Fallout Marathon, just because we want to play it legit. And we're not going for a hundred percent here. It's just going to be a playthrough of the main game, the main quests, and also it's going to be. Some other you know, we probably won't do so many side quests as we will DLC if we have more time. Yeah, you know, this is ridiculous. I have Pokemon Trainer right now. I'm going to show you the same thing. And this is really disappointing, Nintendo, because I never actually had a shot to look at this, which is kind of irresponsible for me since I did a review of the game on Gamers Cast. But... Oh, it just went away. But Pokemon Trainer also was trying to contact me with no avail. Not working out right. I don't know why. I don't know why. Still says he's trying to... Okay, see, so... Look, he's contacting me now. And it just keeps spinning. Very sad, Nintendo, very sad. Oh well. I can't try to talk to you yet until Pokemon Trainer has contacted me or just drops again. What two guys just standing where? <laughs> Um, it's probably going to be a big party like it was on, I'm pretty sure that British map's coming, hold on. Trying to communicate with all hell. Does this work? I don't know. But it's going to be me, Matt, Pat, for sure. And then British map probably will stop by. 
And who knows? Who, who else will stop by? I'm not sure. It was pretty random when British Matt came by, and it was all just fortunate accident. He was in the area just saying hi to Matt, not even knowing that he was doing a marathon, and it worked out for the best. It's... Well, I just switched it up, and I just tried contacting you. <laughs> how about that Minecraft server? Yeah, how about that? Um, well, you know, I don't really uh, think I'm going to be making a server just yet. Uh, it's looking to be uh, something that I need more time for. Uh, that's what it comes down to. Is I'm more or less busy working on... Alright, so this isn't going to work. Wait, hold on. We might actually be able to connect with one of the viewers. Pokemon Trainer, let's see. No, I did not get all the friends in Poke Park. I skipped a lot of obvious ones, too. I'll probably build a server later on, though. I know. Let's say this. By episode 100, there will be a server. We could say that. But actually, next week on PokeChat, I had an invite to a server from the Michael link. The guy who made those Pokemon sprites I did a video of. I took a tour through his Minecraft world. It was pretty fucking awesome. Very well done and all handmade, you know. No cheats, except just having all the blocks that you need. Because who wants to die and mine and collect all the necessary colors for the blocks of wool? I wouldn't. Uh, but really, uh, we might be getting a tour of uh, his server. It has a uh, room for a few pebbles on it. And we'll do that next live cast. But maybe, if there are other servers around that people would like to invite me to, I could join them and they could be a part of the live cast too. Because, uh, you know, it'd be very awesome if we did some co-op gaming together. That's why when I suggest we play Brawl, it's because it's a multiplayer online game. It's not the best of multiplayer online game because it's very much laggy. I'm really pissed off with this. I tried connecting to the Pokemon Trainer. I'm just shutting this off now. That is really just a big disappointment. I wonder if it has to do with the 3DS. Maybe it just can't... Uh, maybe it can't support all the features. I don't know. Five to ten episodes of Minecraft. Dig deep for diamonds. I'm still working on the dive shaft, but as soon as that's done, I guess we can go looking for diamonds. Actually, no. Um, we won't be looking for diamonds. We'll be clearing the way so you guys can have shrines in Minecraft. Wait, wait a second. Have you guys... do? Yeah, I never told you about the shrines, have I? I told you about this in the future episode. I already recorded it. But listen, Pebbles, I don't think Matt said anything about this either, but when you donate at least 50 cents, okay, so that's two quarters. When you donate two quarters to our marathon of Fallout, you will get a shrine in Minecraft, my let's play. So every time I play and we pass, go past the shrine, I can tell all the Pebbles on YouTube, look at that awesome person. That guy right there with the shrine of blocks, he donated X amount of money, and the way that it works is that every 50 cents equals one cobblestone block, and I'm going to make it smooth cobblestone so it does not look all craggy and very ugly in the sky. So you donate a dollar, you get two blocks, but on top of that you get a shine too. So you can comment on your donation what you want to be in your shine, and then it will read that in my Minecraft world. I did say, alright, I did say that about, oh, I'm just making sure, I, I, I know I said it on a uh, episode of Minecraft that's not out yet.